Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Being the Odds. It is Wednesday, June 5th, 2024. We are back with our best bets of the day. If you're new to the channel, my name is Zach, and welcome to Being the Odds. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, hit notification bell so you never miss a pick. We post these best bet videos every single day, and we're going after our first 15,000 subscribers, so I'm really excited to have you all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we had a 3-3 three and three day. Not our best day. Um, Yankees' first five, minus 0 0.5 members only. That was a win. We also have a Nationals' first five, plus 0 0.5 versus the Mets. Disastrous fourth and fifth inning there uh, for my Nationals. Uh, Braves minus one and a half. I got a lot of shit for that one in the comments yesterday. Yeah, they won, so I'm not really sure about that. Plus, a couple comments disappeared, which um, very interesting. Uh, no runs first thing. Seattle and Oakland, that was a win. And then Royals money line blew a 5 nothing lead. It's fucking crazy that we blew a 5 nothing lead. That's insane, just for the record. Like, especially with, you know, how good the, it was. It was ridiculous. And then the Dodgers minus one and a half. I mean... If you told me that going into that game that the Pirates were to score one run the entire game, oh my god, dude, I would be over the fucking moon. But losing one nothing with that many dudes in scoring position was un utterly unbelievable. I mean, I think, I mean, they obviously went over for runner scoring position, but I think they had like nine or ten chances. I mean, like literally every inning, there was a guy on second or a guy on first and third. Like it was frustrating as shit. Um, but that means we're really close. But they're popping back. So the last couple of days, we've been basically just 500. Um, but we're going to bounce back here pretty hard. You guys see the records in the bottom left-hand corner here. And we have three plays today on YouTube that I'm going to give you guys here today. Uh, first off, I'm going to go with Yankees' first five, minus 0 0.5 versus the Twins. I like Rodon more than I like Paddock um, today. I mean, Rodon, first off, is about a run and a half better on the ERA. Uh, both, both, both bullpens here are very, very, very good. So, for me, the minus one and a half could get dicey. And the Yankees lineup, though, is so much better than the Twins. Absolutely unbelievable. I mean, they have my, my, my sunshine, Juan Soto, on their team that I just miss him so much as a Nationals fan. It's ridiculous. Like, he is so good. Like, Juan Soto is such a good player, and the Nats let him walk. It was, oh, my God. We, we, we've let, just completely off topic, we've let Trey Turner, Bryce Harper, Max Scherzer, Juan Soto, all walk and I'm already and I, and I know for a fact I'm forgetting people already just to be honest with you guys I mean it was oh my lord it's been so frustrating but it is what it is the Yankees and plus when you have Juan Soto is even more dangerous when right behind him is Aaron Judge because you can't like really pitch around Juan Soto um and the twins are very reliant on the home run ball and Rodon's not going to do that plus the Yankees are at home I think they start hot today I'm rolling Yankees first five minus 0 0.5 versus the twins next we're going with no runs first inning in Pittsburgh and the Dodgers. Um, first off, <coughs> excuse me, Skeens and Paxton are great. And I mean, they are really, really good. Uh, Paul Skeens, I gave him a lot of shit in that first start because he got blown up. But since then, he's been absolutely unbelievable. Paxton's great as well. And the Dodgers, the Dodgers are going to be better offensively today. But I think they're going to be better later in the game. Uh, especially if they have to get used to Paul Skeens. They haven't seen him before. Um, the Pirates lineup is complete trash. Just, I mean, obviously, they're horrible. And Paxton is a very good pitcher. I think we get out of this inning unscathed. I'm rolling no runs first inning Pittsburgh and, and, and uh, Los Angeles. And then lastly, we're going with Diamondbacks money line versus the Giants. Montgomery is better, and now he's the, the, the better now that he's that he's he's been he's playing he is not as good he's not as bad excuse me as he's been playing. He is way better now he's been playing. And Harrison for San Francisco starting pitching wise is good, but he's but on the road he's been very very suspect. He hasn't been very good on the road. The jump, and listen, I've already given, I've told this a million times in these videos, the Diamondbacks bullpen is complete trash, and I still stand by that. But the Giants bullpen has been even worse than the Diamondbacks, so I like the advantage there. But the D-backs lineup is just so much better than San Francisco. San Francisco can't, doesn't know how to hit a damn beach ball. Plus, the Diamondbacks are at home with elevation. I think Jordan Montgomery plays a hell of a lot better today, and if he does, the Diamondbacks should win this game. I'm rolling the Diamondbacks my line versus the Giants. Now, like I said, we do have, we do have five plays, not three. The two other, two other plays are members only. Best bets. You can go to tdmbets.com slash picks. As a member, you get all our members only plays every single day. You also get a direct line to me. So any game concerning betting, reach out to our hotline number. Get a guaranteed response back by any game concerning betting. And you get all our free picks too on YouTube. Send to you before these videos come out. They'll take advantage of all your lines or the odds. Give those at tdmbets.com slash picks. tdmbets.com slash picks. tdmbets.com slash picks. So guys, so lock in those picks. Let's go win together now. Let's go make some money. I'll see you all tomorrow. Make sure you watch out those other videos.